The Border Roads Organization is conceived and raised in the year 1960 by India's first Prime Minister, the great visionary Pandit Sri Jawaharlal Nehru. The aim was the speedy development of India's road network and infrastructure in the northern and northeastern border areas of the country as a strategic initiative to support the armed forces. Biharu conceived primarily as a road building agency. Here, the 60 has over the years spread its swings and diversified into a large spectrum of construction and development operations comprising road projects, defense works, bridging, and tunneling. With just two projects in 1960, Today, there are 18 projects in Special Task Force spread from east to west and north to south, with prime presence being at the north and the northeast. It takes extraordinary men to take on extraordinary challenges. Building roads can seem like an ordinary task, but not when it is undertaken in the toughest terrains. Where building a path seems impossible, brave men have created highways and opened up frontiers. The Border Roads Organization is made up of people who have put in blood and sweat with a never-say-die attitude. Shrameen Sarvam Sadhyam is the motto of BRO that helped it achieve marvels across India, especially in the toughest and most challenging areas of forests, mountains and deserts. The roots of the Border Roads Organization go back to the time of independence when the country did not have infrastructure for transport. More importantly, lack of roads along the borders was a potential risk to national security. However, it was not until 1960 that a concerted effort was made to improve road infrastructure network 1,000 people formed the nucleus of an organization that started with two projects. The organization currently boasts of 40,000 engineers, builders and administrators with lakhs of casual laborers working on various projects. The four C's exemplify BRO, courage, Competence, confidence and commitment are its watchwords that have helped it take on the mightiest challenges and succeed where others would have simply shelved a project as not being feasible. BRO came into being as Border Roads Development Board in May 1960 with the objective of developing road networks in the north and northeast regions of India. The Prime Minister acted as chairman and the Defence Minister was the deputy chairman. The board mutated into the BRO and became a department of the Government of India under the Ministry of Defence, with the Defence Minister acting as chairman and the board made up of members from the army and air wings of the military. The structure of BRO is made up of the main BRO and the General Reserve Engineer Force. GREF, made up of civil, electrical, mechanical engineers from the Army Corps of Engineers.
BRO has a strategic reach covering entire India with emphasis on North and Northeast and the Western borders in addition to Bhutan, Myanmar, Tajikistan and Afghanistan where it has working alliances with governments. Modeled along with the lines of the army with platoon hierarchy, the BRO is entrusted with the task of surveying, preparing feasibility reports and implementation such as formation, cutting, surfacing, safety mechanisms and development of roads, bridges, tunnels, causeways and airfields. More importantly, it has a well-knit division solely tasked with emergency response to keep roads in the vulnerable areas of northeast and the north free of obstructions such as snowfalls and landslides. In addition, in the event of natural disasters, BRO has a fast response team that swings into action to initiate rescue and repair procedures. BRO simultaneously handles various projects through its divisions comprised of task forces, bridge construction companies, road construction companies, and drain maintenance companies in addition to support groups. It has a well-developed workshop, training center, resource center, and facilities for staff members. Much of its success owes to its research and development establishment that came into being in May 2011. Specialists undertake studies on tackling issues in the toughest terrains and recommending solutions as well as providing ongoing support during execution. The division has helped induct latest processes and equipments for construction, maintenance, repairs and rebuilding. BRO can proudly lay claim to prestigious projects Vast in scope, Chetak project of BRO focused on Jaisalmer encompasses a huge area covering the southwestern, western and southern commands of the army spread over Gujarat, Rajasthan and Punjab. Chetak is inspired by the horse of the same name that bore the valiant hero Maharana Pratap. The project encompasses 4,200 km of roads across the tough Thar Desert and in hospital terrains along the sensitive Indo Pak border. The initial phase was undertaken on a war footing along the Indo China border to provide logistic support to the army following the Chinese aggression. A side benefit of this activity was the construction of the Rishikesh Badrinath pilgrimage route. This project was resurrected following the Indo Pak conflict in 1971 and was implemented from April 1980, headquartered in Bikaner. The main objective was to improve roads in Rajasthan and Punjab, progressing later onto the arid areas of the Thar Desert where people had to work in biting cold of winter and scorching heat of summer as well as sandstorms. They came, they saw, they worked, they overcame and 
जैसलमेर बीकानेर श्री गंगानगर कैन प्राउडली बोस्ट ऑफ अ फाइन नेटवर्क ऑफ रोड्स दैट हैव इंप्रूव्ड क्वालिटी ऑफ लाइफ ऑफ दिस रीजन